Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Today's topic is about how to fix iPhone or iPad screen won't rotate after iOS update. Before starting this video, you should know that some apps or screens only support landscape or portrait mode. Solution 1 is turn off portrait orientation lock. Make sure that you have turned off portrait orientation lock. To check open control center, if you see portrait orientation lock in red color, you can't rotate your screen. Tap it to turn off it. Solution 2 is set standard for view. If you want to rotate your home screen, follow these steps. Home screen rotation only works with iPhone Plus models like iPhone 6 Plus, iPhone 6s Plus, iPhone 7 Plus. Other iPhone models home screen can only be viewed in portrait mode. If you have iPhone Plus models, want the home screen to rotate, then do this. Launch settings app on your iPhone. Find and tap on display and brightness. Scroll down the screen and tap on view. Set standard. Then tap use standard to confirm this action. Solution 3 is reset all settings. Go to settings app. Scroll down the screen and tap on general. Again scroll down the screen to bottom and tap on reset. Tap on reset all settings, enter the passcode and again tap to confirm. Solution 4 is set size switch for iPad. If you have an iPad with a size switch, you can set the size switch to work as a rotation lock or mute switch. First go to settings app on your iPad. Select general. Under use size switch to select the option that you want. Solution 5 is force restart your iPhone. If you are using iPhone 8 and later, quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, press and hold the side button and volume down button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 6 and 6 Plus, press and hold the home button. While holding the home button, press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. Hope you guys any one of these solutions worked for you. If you have any doubt regarding this video, let me know through your comments. For more videos, subscribe to Apple Tech page.